What I will say is, Boston, they haven't been battle tested. I don't know if that's a good thing to get battle tested yeah, in the finals. True. I don't know if you want to get battle tested yeah, in, yeah, in the yeah. finals. Yeah. I don't know if you want to be battle tested by Denver or Minnesota or one of those teams. That might be too late to get battle tested. Hmm. You think it's too late? Do you, do, would you like to see those tests earlier on? Absolutely. I'm going to say the Mavs just because a lot of different reasons. One is, first of all, they played a better competition, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. And I think about the Celtics. Who'd you guys really beat, though? Who'd you really beat? I'm taking Ooh. Kyrie, Ooh. and I am taking Luka before Ooh. I take the best player on the Celtics, Jalen Brown, mm. and the second best player, Jalen Are you delusional? Do you I was saying that I was leaning strongly toward Dallas, right? All week when it looked like they had that series in hand against Minnesota. And now after seeing last night, it's an easy choice for me. There you go. Dallas. There you go. There you go. Like, I think they have the best player in the series. By a lot. Going with with uh, Dallas. I'm picking six. I thought about five. Well, I, yeah, five. I, I, I'm I thought on the about record five. Dallas and five. <laughs> I feel like the Eastern Conference and the injuries did the Celtics a disservice. Like, I don't think that they are ready for this difficulty jump that they're about to deal with. And that. You serious? <laughs> Boston concerns me because it's too much one on one, UD. Mm -hmm. It's not JB and JT feeding off of each other it's your turn my turn your turn my turn okay and I'm looking at it from that standpoint and I'm saying I'm looking at the way Luca and Kyrie are feeding off of one mm -hmm. another I'm looking at how they're feeding the other guys you know PJ Washington you know if he's making shots the, the way he's been making shots I think Dallas gonna win the championship yeah. but the first thing I thought about when I saw that deal is Lord have mercy if you're on that side, just stay on that side. That's all I got to say. So Tatum was not ready when he first got into the league. He's not as good as LeBron, not as good as Steph, not as good as the old guard. And now he's not as good as the young guard was his window two years ago. And this is why I don't think they're going to get it done. If you don't have a guy who has already been either an MVP or damn close, you don't win. The enormous weight of massive expectations ends tonight here it's over time to say it again boston anything's possible batter number 18 has been secured to finals mvp jalen brown and to the 2024 